Thank you, Andy. It's absolutely fantastic to be here this evening. This year saw a resurgence of E3 in Los Angeles, which I hope you all agree was a great success for the industry as a whole. And of course, in September, we'll be at the Tokyo Game Show, which as always is going to be a very unique event, really showcasing the Japanese obsessive passion for gaming. But looking at the fantastic event that we have right here in Cologne this year, I think it's very clear that we now have a third major day on our gaming calendars. One that I'm very excited to be a part of, and one that SCE is looking forward to supporting for many, many years to come. This event clearly highlights how the gaming industry in Europe has changed and really grown beyond recognition over the past 15 years. Not only are the sales of our products in Europe incredibly strong, but we see great gaming uh, games coming out of our European studios, including some of PlayStation 3's biggest brands, Killzone, Motorstorm, SingStar, and of course, Little Big Planet. To have a major global event in Europe that celebrates the industry as a whole and brings the world's media together with hundreds of thousands of consumers is a great thing that I certainly wholeheartedly applaud. But of course, I'm not just here to celebrate this fantastic event. I'm actually here to help Andy demonstrate to you how PlayStation is moving forward, not simply following the patterns of the industry, but shaping the future of our industry. And it's the shape and form that I would like to talk to you about today. Did you think this podium was here just to stand here for the entire evening? Not really. So in 2004, as you may recall, we launched a slim version of PlayStation 2, a defining moment for that console, helping us to really expand the user base of PlayStation 2 further. And of course, today is that day for PlayStation 3. Allow me to introduce the latest version of PlayStation 3, available in stores throughout the world, from the first week of September. <laughs> Just make sure it stands properly. That's why the stand was here, as some of you may have noticed. Anyway, so with the same features and functionality of the current PlayStation 3, the latest model here with its 120 gigabyte hard drive disk is 32% smaller, 36% lighter, and has 34% less power consumption than the original PlayStation 3. But that's actually not the most important stat that I can give you this evening. The most important figures are two, nine, and nine. And in case you haven't figured out what that number means, it's the price. This version of PlayStation 3 will be available at an RRP of 299 euros, $299 in the United States, and 29,980 yen in Japan. And I'm also pleased to announce that throughout the SCE territories, and in the US, this price will be available in stores as of tomorrow for the current model of the PlayStation 3 as well. So with that, I will pass you back to Andy. Thank you very much for allowing me to share this fantastic news with everyone this evening. And of course, ladies and gentlemen, please enjoy the rest of Gamescom. Thank you. <laughs> 